Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel, Jamila here, and today I'm gonna to be showing you an easy, minimal, everyday sort of, uh, I'm gonna be doing a get ready with me. So this is pretty much get ready with me for a working from home or for like, you can do it for if you go to the office too. Sort of a minimal, everyday, get ready with me look. I'm gonna be doing it for working from home because um, I work from home. <laughs> I have a few video calls, so you know, sometimes I like to get a little, presentable and yeah i'm going to be featuring this beauty brand called merit they're a clean beauty brand they're all about minimalistic beauty um and they're a luxury brand too which is really nice so this is clean beauty luxury brand merit they gifted me with a few makeup items and what i really like about this brand is one that it's clean and two that they really push for minimal beauty and they really emphasize enhancing your natural beauty and only using what you need like the bare minimum only the essentials so they have recently launched they're in sephora now and they're part of the clean at sephora program which is super nice yeah i also love that they're a luxury brand the packaging you can see that in their packaging is gorgeous very beautiful packaging um so yeah i'm going to be featuring mary in this video um and just using the essentials to get my little everyday makeup look. I mean, I'm just working from home, so I'm gonna be using them in my get ready with me, doing my hair, and um, throwing on my little working from home fit. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and thank you, Merit, for gifting me with these products. I really appreciate it. Um, so let's get on to the video, and I'll stop talking. All right, so I did line my brows with uh, eyebrow pencil. Um, it's like a cheap 99 cent eyebrow pencil. So now I'm gonna go in with the Brow 1980 Volumizing Pomade and this gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous packaging. Look how cute this is. And so since I have my brows already outlined, I'm just gonna, um, oh. So since I have my brows outlined already, I'm just going to sort of like fill them in with the brow pomade. And this is pretty much how, this is how I've been doing my brows lately, just doing an outline with the pencil, and then I go in with some kind of pomade to fill them in so it's sort of like a natural look. And this looks good. So now I'm gonna go in with this Perfecting Complexion Stick, and this is in the color Chestnut. And this can be used as a foundation stick, concealer stick, contour stick, depending on the color that you get it in. And I'm gonna use the, ch the color Chestnut to clean up my brows a little bit. It's a little bit lighter than my skin tone, um, but it's a really good color to clean the brows up with for my skin tone. This spread's really easy. It's easy to work with, easy to move, which is great. And I do need to like <laughs> fix my brows, but I decided this week, well, I recently I decided that I'm just gonna let them grow out totally, and then I'm gonna clean them up. But I just, I just really wanna start from the beginning and let them fully grow out before I like, wax or pluck them again. I'm just gonna spread this out, blend it in. I love how easy this blends into my skin, oh my gosh. So now I'm gonna use the Perfecting Complexion Stick in Sepia, and I'm just going to, this is like my skin tone, so I'm just going to sort of dot it on the marks that I have, you know, this is just a little everyday look, keeping it very minimal, very light. And this is so creamy, oh my God. It spreads so easily. Okay. Nothing crazy. And then I have a damp um, beauty, splunt, beauty sponge, and I'm just going to just blend it in. I'm gonna do a little more. All right, so this is what we're looking like as far as like a foundation. 
So now I'm going to go in with the chestnut again, and I'm going to just apply this for my concealer. I didn't get a darker shade um, stick, but I like to I like to contour, and I think that like a cream contour is more. Uh, it's just more natural sometimes so i'm gonna go in with this revolution um, foundation stick in f18 and i'm just going to add a little bit of contour on my face just a little bit now i'm not a big highlighter person um but i did get this highlighter in uh, it's a highlighting balm and I got it in bounce. So I am gonna sort of highlight the nose just a little bit. Yeah. Nothing crazy. Um, and then I'm going to sort of wrap up my face and I'm going to powder now. I'm just gonna use a little bit of this Sasha Buttercup and then I'm gonna mix it with my Laura Mercier, Laura Mercier Translucent Medium Deep Powder. And I'm gonna mix this up in the top. I'm gonna to use my, my sponge. And I'm going to take the excess and just dab it on my rinse. And then go in. On my lip, on my chin. It's pretty much on my T-zone where I'm gonna apply this powder with my sponge. Around my eyebrows, because they get oily. And then I'm just going to use a little bit of Laura Mercier powder and powder the rest of my face just very lightly. Powder is essential for me because I have pretty oily skin. So I gotta keep that under control. And then I'm just going to take this brush and I'm going to go in with my Milani um, pressed powder in Earth Glow. And this is a very like, this is a very like bronze warm brown color is great for a bronzer for darker skin tones and so because i already contoured i'm just going to go straight in with this and just do a little bit of light warming up nothing crazy at all and now i'm going to use a little blush so i have this cheek color it's in raspberry barrett and also, these products don't really have a scent, which is also very nice. They don't seem to be scented at all, so I think that's good. Probably should have put this on before, but I'm just gonna like dab a little bit over here. Nothing crazy. Ooh. I definitely should have put this on before I powdered my face, but it's okay. We're just gonna roll with it. This is very creamy, and so I feel like I'm sort of rubbing off my makeup, but it's okay, this is pretty. This wasn't the color I initially wanted, but this is actually a really nice color for me. It's nice. And so I'm just gonna go in with my concealer. I'm sorry, I'm gonna go in with some mascara. And this is in perfect back. It's a lengthening mascara. All right. All right, so now that I have my whole face done, I'm going to go in with this lip liner, um, and this is by Minted, and this is, hmm, I don't know what color this is. Maybe it's called Night? Minted Night Lip Pencil. Yeah, I'm not sure what color it is, but it's a nice brown color. Um, I'm just gonna line my lips, this. Then I'm gonna go in with this gorgeous colors in um, All Natural, and this is a tinted lip oil. Very cute, and it smells scentless. I love that. I love it. Sort of like a peachy nude color, and it has a good color payoff. So, because I'm going for something more natural i'm not gonna put too much I'm just gonna blend this in 
all right and so now i'm gonna move on with my hair my hair is looking um interesting so i'll be back and we're gonna get this hair together all right so i just have my hair um i washed my hair yesterday morning so i just put it in these little two braid things um and so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna put my hair this is like one of my favorite protective styles i wear my hair a lot like i wear my hair like this a lot especially <laughs> since i'm working from home um but my other protective style which is what i'm gonna put my hair in now my other favorite is this bun i've done a video about this and i just use this mesh bun maker and it's really great because it helps stretch my hair out it just keeps my hair neat and detangled and it's just convenient and it still looks nice and classy so that's what i'm going to do today All right, so now that my hair is setting, I'm just gonna let it set so that the talking is smooth. I'm going to change, which is pretty much just gonna be, I don't know, definitely gonna be wearing sweatpants and some kind of top, maybe it's, I'm Marco from home, so some kind of comfortable top. So I will be right back. All right, so this is my hair what I'm rocking with today. Like I said, this is one of my favorite protective styles other than like wearing my hair in the two twist braids. But yeah, um, as far as clothes, I just put on this big top, sort of like a, like a big long sleeve t-shirt. Um, yeah, it's pretty much like a big long sleeve t-shirt I got on the clearance aisle in Target. I thought it was cute, it's sort of, distress look around the neck and then it has cute flower and then i just have on some black sweatpants so yes this is my work fit for today um nothing crazy i mean i just have a few like on camera meetings so it's not a big deal people are pretty casual but yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this video honestly this makeup was so easy to use this hairstyle i highly recommend it if you have natural hair um and the clothing is comfortable too so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful as always thank you so much for watching if you did like it be sure to leave a comment down below give a thumbs up to let me know you enjoyed it and subscribe for more also if you're interested in the merit products this gorgeous minimalist clean beauty brand be sure to check my description box for the link and yeah as always thank you so much for watching and i will talk to you all next time bye